All right, guys, we are here in Sacon, New Jersey with our boy Tony, and he's gonna tell us a little bit about this Chevy pickup he's got here. Yes, sir. All right. All right, I'll let Tony take it away. All right, it's a 39 Chevy body. Uh, started out at a 49 F6 frame. It's about six foot left of it. Z-notch the front, C-notch the rear, four link rear, three link front. QA1's in the back, Fox 2.5's in the front. It's got 06 Super Duty 373 axles, 273 transfer case, four 100 trans, uh, full built 12 outs, 800 horse, uh, side draft, steed speed, 472, five by 16s, ferrule maxed out 160 pump, uh, fire ringed head, uh, air to water, Ready yeah, in the back. Can we, can we go look at the yeah, engine? Yeah. Right. All right. So where did you get the uh, 12 valve out of? Just harvest out of a second gen, or? Well, yeah. This I actually got in Connecticut um, as a long block with a ZF5 trans. Sold the trans. Got this. Sent this to over to Miller's Machine Shop. He did the whole long block for us. Um, Keating intake or. Keating intake runner, uh, Keating timing cover, valve cover, uh, air to water intercooler. Any upgrades on the pump? Yeah, it's a maxed out ferrule. Flows about 430. With a 160 pump, it's about two horsepower per cc. So it's probably around like 750, 800 on fuel. Five by 16s from Haley. Now on the exterior of the body, it's pretty. Looks pretty much all stock. Yes. Except for a couple of fitment issues. Yep. Um, when we got the truck from North Dakota, took pictures of the body, like the pitch of the fenders and everything, because they're all off. They were uh, half-ass welded, I guess you can say. <laughs> pretty, it's pretty much brazed together, this yep. whole stuff. Um, the pitch of the fenders, you got more gap on one side or the other, but I yep. like it. Left okay. everything like it is. All right, let's go around to the back. So the bed's a little bit more custom than the cab. Yes, yes. Me and my dad, family friend, we did this. It's about 60 hours in this. Oh. So this is more of a flat bar style versus the extruded, uh, yes. extruded strips. Yes, this actually a lot has. Simpler. If you pop this open, made a frame for this. This is completely removable altogether. If I take the cool lines off, yeah. Made a whole frame here for it. Two bolts on each side, I can take this all off. I take the filler neck off. Yep, very cool. Custom radiator mount in the back. Yep. A little bit more room. Anything yeah. interesting with these saw blades here or just something you had laying yeah, around? Just something there, debating on putting fenders on the back. Uh, it was hard to find a 30 inch saw blade for the radius of it, but yep. it worked. Plug welded it on the side. Took out eight, 16 inches off the bed, shortened it, started out as a long bed. And what kind of wheels we got going on? These are super rare. These are billet specialties, eight by 170. These are from 2000 or 2001. This is one of the last sets that I know of. Huh. Super there. duty, eight by 178 lug. They only made a handful of these. Nitto tires. Yup. And finish off with the interior. Yup. 06 King Ranch seats. Um, the seats are actually the rears because they're narrower and thinner bolsters. The pans are from the front. All the heat and control modules on here, you just need to power and ground, unlike the new ones where everything's underneath the dash. Uh, B&M ratchet shifter. The E-brake is a Super Duty firewall mounted brake that I mounted this way. Cut the foot pedal off, extended it, put a trench knife handle on it. <laughs> it's the E-brake, pull it there. Uh, Cup holders are a rototiller depth handle with two boost clamps and 7.3 lifting eyes. There's a cup holder there. Uh, and how about those gauges? The gauges, those are all Omegas on the uh, top. Basically, they're for a gas job. Um, and then the just regular is pro gauges on that. Um, just your regular trans boost pyro. Cool. EGT in the floor, kind of just made the floor work. It's very tight <laughs> underneath there. I imagine these small cabs are yeah. a little bit of a squeeze. Yeah, I just put the trans in last night. It was a little, a little longer than I thought I'm trying to get in there. All right, Tony, where can we find you online? Oh, like an Instagram? Or yeah. Uh, I soot my pants. I soot my That's pants. It. All right. Yeah. All right, thanks, Tony. No we'll see you on the next one. <laughs>